Oh. What time do you usually wake up? No, you don't. This is what I look like waking up at 8 a.m. <laughs> Absolutely shattered. You can tell I'm not used to waking up at this time because look at that. The sun is perfectly rising through that gap in the trees and I'm used to seeing it all the way up there. Flipping egg, Mr. Tony. Welcome to the house. Welcome to the house of fun where he's brought his tools. We've got paper, we've got machinery. We've got step ladders, and these are all the tools this man needs to decorate this house to turn it to a home. I've brought a tennis racket. <laughs> <laughs> all right, it's all go, go, go yet again. As I welcome your faces to a new dawn and a new day. Because my name is Tom, and I film every single weekday of my life. And I can't quite open my eyes just yet. I'm not joking, they're sealed shut with sleep as my alarm literally went off at eight o'clock, and it is like 8.03. I'm very tired. But if it's wakey wakey time, that also means it's feeding time. And do you know what I've just realised? This whole getting up early thing is a really good training method for when I'm going to be a dad. Because in 41 days, little jelly man's going to be here and I'm going to wish I was woken up at 8 o'clock in the morning after 7 hours sleep. Woo! Let's start this day. Oh my gosh, what is he doing? Welcome to the madhouse. We're in T minus 50 minutes. The flooring guys will be back to put down our brand new floor all the way through the lounge and through what we're calling the playroom. And they up, speak of the devils and they shall rise. Oh, it is. You're right, lads. Mr. Cool's arrived. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I've had comments from people. I'm going to put it on screen right now. <laughs> Tell me right here, right now. He's baseline Bert. Here he is. <laughs> He's a DJ. Can't believe it. Tony, there is no messing around. They're all going for it, the boys. All the tools are out. You didn't prep me that this was happening. It makes so much more sense that you were drilling there. I, I just I just thought you were doing it for the camera. <laughs> With all these noises going on, I feel like I'm in a dentist. <laughs> now go on, let's see how man like Tony's getting on it. Hey! What? How did I scare you? That's looking much better. Even though it looks like much worse with the holes in the wall and stuff, at least the glue is off. And yes, I've had a shower, so I look a little bit fresher. And now apparently, whoa, what are you doing here, mate? Making sure it's perfect, boys. You're you. scratching me floor like. <laughs> did someone say rubbing down? <laughs> hey! But someone did say it's time to start getting this floor down. And this just looks like the biggest headache of a jigsaw puzzle <laughs> I have ever seen. Is that you going around for the wires? Yeah. Oh. This is going to blow my mind if I stare at it any longer, so I'm going to set up a time lapse. Now, while that time lapse is going on downstairs, it would seem like Tony is having a rave in here. <laughs> oh, mate, this is an absolute tune. Look at this. We're cracking on, we're cracking on, we're cracking on. Very good. And very nice. Hey mate, this is looking, this is looking amazing. I can't believe it. You actually met him. <laughs> very good, very nice. Very good, very nice. There you go, this is going to be the one fucking piece of flooring that everyone looks at and goes, why is that piece? Put it there, Tom. Put it there, look at that yeah. one. Yeah. Hard right, one. Make sure there's no gaps. Eh? No, it's the time, just don't like it. Come on, and we're in. Spit on it. Spit on it. <laughs> Look at that. Beautiful. Absolutely wonderful. Yeah, Tom. One Next one. Like yeah. Oh, I've got another fucking minute. He's paying <laughs> And now for my next trick. I have to empty this entire room because, oh my gosh, there's just so much shit in it. And I need to empty absolutely every single thing in here because guests are coming staying in this room tonight. So there's no time like the present. 
one step at a time or you could say one leg at a time <laughs> this is gonna take ages and in an episode of here's what i moved earlier luckily one of the lads managed to help me bring this bad boy down because i was not shifting that myself now this simply needs to go so goodbye motherfucker out you go goodbye see you another day see ya bye bye smile and wave boys one item at a time and down into the dark dungeon it goes i will say it actually feels way more organized in here the fact that like you know we have everything to the side and on the shelves I'm a very happy man. I still can't quite wrap my head around how empty this entire space is. Like it's giving me flashbacks to like when the house was first built, but it's not like it's tidied and organized. It's just, it's just over there. We're settling somewhere. I just asked Tony if he wanted a Coke and he asked for Pepsi Max. <laughs> What's better, Coke or Pepsi Max? Or roller Cola. Ro roller Cola. Coke. It's gotta be Coke, right? Coke. No one ever asks for a Pepsi Max. Get back into your room. <laughs> I'm not proud of it, but I actually have some Pepsi from like a Domino's delivery. So Tony gets what he wants. Are you ready? Let's see if I tell Tony this is Coca-Cola, if he can tell it's Pepsi. Tell me that's not better. Just tell me that's not better. You tell me you don't prefer Coke over Pepsi. It is Pepsi. <laughs> I found a bottle. Oh God. Just like that, the final piece final of the piece. new lounge has gone in. What do you think, Joe? It's crazy, isn't it? Wow, I love it. I absolutely love it. Oh no, <laughs> don't you dare. And there's a green. This room is finished. Yes, I love it. The yeah. All right, these guys are going to get on with that room, so I'm leaving another camera rolling. Whilst they work, I'm on my wheels. And I'm going to butty shop. Because a hungry worker is not a happy worker. And to be fair, this is a good excuse to get out of the house and not move all the shit that I need to shift. I really can't be bothered. But I've got a bone to pick with these lot. I rang up to place the order and oh boy! Oh, I think you can put the phone down on me, do you? <laughs> you little shit, I came here in person! Put that phone down just like you did to me! So it's just so lovely going to the local butty shop. But I got the gear. And I'm taking it back to the guys. Oh, I bring the goods, yes? You, you, don't want to, you don't want to know what I had to do to get this. Oh my lordy. You probably didn't think I've already noticed it. What? But I've already spotted it. Don't blame me. I've already <laughs> spotted it. How did you get that up there? Who did it? Who put it there? I've already spotted it. <laughs> There's no way you managed to get that all the way up there. That is brilliant. And it's just all systems that go, I guess, because the delivery has arrived. Mate, this is the life, this is the true life of Tom, just everything always happening at once. And ta-da! Let the madness commence. Because I need to store those boxes. Open door, open sesame, thank you. In the basement for now. Hence why it's empty. And luckily, it is a lovely day to do it for once. Oh, look who has arrived with the baby! Hello, mate! Are we waving yet? Are we waving yet? No, not quite. One day you will master the art of waving, but until that day comes, um, we will just wait. But look at him, he's a happy little fella. Now, do you want the good news or the bad news? It's only bad news. Uh, it's only bad news. The good news is you're a legend, right? Uh, and I love you. But the bad news is your butty got forgotten about. The butty shop. I need to stop it. You bastards. I'll go back down and get it. I've just uh, also. I've got to get rid of the cake. <laughs> <laughs> I've got to get rid of some cake. This is little Harlem. This is little boy. Say hello. You got you to a DJ session. Yeah, Look at the new floor. Wow. Wow. Yeah, yeah. You all sit over there with your food whilst you've done all the hard work. Yeah, I noticed that. that. Yeah, Alice. Yeah. See what I mean? Thank you. Free yeah, you are, you are. You two gonna have to work for it. <laughs> Tony already gets free t-shirts. He's a syndicate original VIP. Just stop spoiling everything. All right, go on then. Can what I you like to walk on it? Yeah, of course you are. <gasps> what? <laughs> oh, it's nice. You like it? Don't walk in that room, it's not finished yet. What do you reckon? It, yeah. yeah? It's like a different place, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, I like it. It seems bigger. Yeah, because it seems bigger because there's no furniture yeah, in it. Bigger. Wow. Are you I'm, I'm not gonna love it! 
Karen, you're filming me. You're filming me. What Aye. a bloke. Hey, Karen. How are you doing? I'm fine. You're going to have to your house. Oh, she's got a mouse full of food. She's eating something. It just never stops, does it, in this house? I, I, in the two days you've been on the site, how mad is it? Mad. <laughs> DJ Birdsauce. How are we DJing well? <laughs> 20 <laughs> hours Oh, he's, here we go. He's trying to get... Where are you DJing? 29th of September. This month. What's your DJ name again? Birdsauce. D where did Bertos come from? Some famous man. I, I know you are. Yes, I'm Bert. Fuck it. So the 29th of September, Mint Lounge, Manchester. Yeah, we're going in, mate. If anyone... day later, I'm playing at Sunbirds <laughs> in Darwin for Infrared, doing a tech. Go on, set. keep it going. If it's anyone insane. goes, send me videos of him setting me like, fucking Tom sent us. Yes, Bertos. <laughs> and he'll, he'll, buy, he'll buy you a beer. Definitely. Hey! How are you being dragged into it? Nino! The back, everyone's here. I have found the most efficient way to move the boxes and vlog at the same time. <laughs> I'm very smart, man. No, 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 no. <laughs> Woo! I ho, I ho, in the house we go. <laughs> I ho. What's he doing? Wait, I can't see him. <laughs> you right there, little dude? What are you doing? What are you doing over there? The ants gather their supplies to take down to the nest. <laughs> They, they they take it to the queen to keep her happy. <laughs> and the defence at the back is big and strong and brawn. What are the chances that when we're at the house next door, the neighbours come and help us move it, and now the, these guys are here to help shift the rest of them? We've proper looked out, haven't we? Yeah. You right there? Yeah. <laughs> She's knackered walking up Karam and Jaro. But ta-da, the boxes are gone. They're down in the basement, and now I await my next interaction of the day. Which you can't write, has quite literally just turned up in the form of a Ken. And look at that, his little companions with him. It's the doggy. I didn't know your name was Walter White. <laughs> He's turned me bloody house into a drug cook den. What have you done to the lights? <laughs> This is mental, Tony! What do you just call it? A kill room. If there's a... Well, actually, we really shouldn't advertise that in G-Cross because there's been many mass murderers where they're from. Are you really going to be the next one? What do you mean? I thought we'd have to be like, oh yeah, I mean, that guy was such a nice guy, but then yeah, he was a mass murderer. That'd be really unfortunate, you know. I, I couldn't kill a flea, mate. Oh. I couldn't kill a flea. <clears throat> but isn't that what a mass murderer would say? Hey, Tony, I've got your first victim. You ready? Come with me. He's there. He'd, he'd never see it coming. Just drown him in the... <laughs> don't worry, Tony. <laughs> no one will know. I don't think I gave any context as to why my dad was here. And it was the fact that the toilet is broken. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, wait. Are you actually done already? That was it. Mate, you were here less than like four minutes. What of... Come here. High five. High five, Dad. It's not a case of who you know. It's a case of what you know. In this circumstance, <laughs> yes, it is. Where do you think you're going? I've done my bit, mate. <laughs> Thank you so much. Mate, I, I genuinely do mean it. When, when, we, when we spoke, I, I didn't expect you to come round and be like, right, I'm coming tomorrow. Well, it's, so best, thank you. it's best just to get it out of the way. If you need a man who gets shit done, Tony Smith. I don't know why I'm saying this, because you're always busy. I know. <laughs> but thank you. Bye. I really, really, really appreciate you. Hey, and more importantly, my child appreciates you. See you tomorrow at 8am. <sighs> okay, down into the madhouse we go. I put the GoPro batteries on charge. And I go around this corner to find, oh, all the troops at the office. The troops, troops, troops at the office. Oh my God, dude, is that the brand new? Is that the brand new Syndicate, Syndicate original summer collection? Oh my gosh, dude. So this is the first delivery of four. Wow. So we started sending them out on Monday the 18th. Wow. And we're just gonna keep going and going and going until they're gone. Wow. That is some Syndicate original shirts at, mm, thanks Alice. <laughs> just watch, and then some. This is where they do the packing. This is very good, yeah, very good. Yes, this is nice. My station. Alice's station wait, at, wait, the, at the bar. Wait, wait. Oh, okay, well. This is uh, the escaping child. Get back in my basement, otherwise I fight you. <laughs> I feel like I should be stopping him from going up this hill. <laughs> but he's just so determined. You can do it. <laughs> Climb, Karamanjaro child. Climb it. Okay, let me get a bit closer in case he rolls. I'm, I'm like your Sherpa supporting you. You can do it. You can do it. <laughs> He's halfway up by himself. I'm well impressed. I'm just worried about his little foot that he keeps scraping along the, on the floor. Oh, look at him. News just in. Child summits Karamanjaro. <laughs> I'm going to be a responsible father, right? Yeah. 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 
Oh, well done. Well, <laughs> what the heck? Do you see those dad reactions? Yay! Well done. Yeah, well done. Look at what you just climbed up. Oh my gosh, dude. I'm well impressed. Right, mate, don't worry. I won't make you crawl back down it because you will probably tumble, but I will indeed carry you. I will indeed carry you. Well, don't look too happy about it. <laughs> yeah, still not sure about that one. And we still can't sit still because I've got to go somewhere. Uber Tom is in full swing because there's a lady on the streets that I need to collect. But this bastard, get what? Get, <laughs> You just gotta love working here, don't you? <laughs> and hello, lady of the road. Are you okay? I should have said all the years ago. Well, if you saw what was happening in the front of your house, you understand why I've just got it. <laughs> your Royal Highness, after you. Ooh, big belly. Are you ready for season four? Oh. You ready? Come on in. Do, 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 do. It looks way better. Way better. How does what work? <laughs> Put Derek down and step away from the robotic device. He's just going for it. I have no idea. He'll have no idea where he's been, where he is. He's, no, he has to. He has to start mapping out the area. He has no idea where he is right now. Look at him go. Go, Derek. Go, 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 Derek. If you're using my cleaning shit, 85 quid. <laughs> this is the most important thing. Do you like it? A little bit. Hey! Hey! Go on! Go on, TFI! Yeah. Go on, TFI! You were saying you're going to miss working it. Yeah, I'm going to miss working it. I'm, gonna miss, I'm, gonna miss, I'm just tempted to just start ripping up every floor in the house now and get his back. <laughs> yeah, 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 you're like, pay hey, me. Just so good. So, so good. Where's. I can't believe I know two Wes's. It's been a pleasure. Wait, it's been a pleasure. Magic, quit. Oh, please. I know. Oh, oh good thing. Let's go to Wes. <laughs> Next time you're having a get together now. Big DJ! It's been mint. It's been absolutely mint. And yes, we'll hook you up with some Syndicate original swag. Is that right? Yeah, yeah. Go on, boys. Yeah, hey, we look after our friends. Yes, the boy. Give us a spin. Let's see the back. Let's see the back. Yeah, that looks sick. That actually suits you. That looks so good. Are we getting away with yeah, it? Yeah, that looks great. Yeah. Yeah, 1XL. Perfect, mate. You like it? Yes. Yes. And the last one in black. Go on, give us a spin. Go on, the boy. What did you literally just say? We don't want to go, Willow. Yeah, get the beers out. We don't want to go. We're looking for excuses to stay. Hey, Wes, where did you just go? What did you just say walking away? You said get the beers out. I was already at the fridge. Cheers. Cheers, boys. <laughs> cheers cheers my man cheers Thank you. cheers legend oh the boys are always useful for something thanks tfi i appreciate you oh this is wild and you know what i kind of like this color sofa on this floor it looks well good <laughs> hey we brought the smallest piece you stupid idiots you idiots hey listen this was so worth a free t-shirt thanks boys oh we got one more piece to move i'm here don't worry don't worry <laughs> Look at that! The sofa's back! Hey yo, everything's back! Look at this! It's it's brilliant! Like, don't get me wrong, it doesn't look good. There's holes in this, the skirting board's missing, there's dust all over that. But at least now for the next six weeks, we'll have our kitchen back and dining room. Yes! I can't believe we've got our latest syndicate originally boy. Look at him! Who's ordering you back in there? Who's is it? Yeah. Come on! Come on! Yeah! Oh my gosh, he's doing it! No, you're so no, hello. So close yet, so far. All right, all systems are ready to go, and you better be on your top form. Hey, hey, you better. <laughs> bye now. Bye bye now. You start work tomorrow. Bye bye now. Bye bye now. <laughs> but all right, um, you'll notice Lydia's car is not here and that's because she's gone to pick up a special guest who's going to be staying with us for the next few days i can't really say the house is in any sort of state for hosting but you know what 
it is what it is, and uh, we're just going to go with it, all right? There's nothing I can do about it. I'm just stoked that we've got the floor in. We've actually got the sofa back upstairs, which is just brilliant. Because now we've got somewhere to sit for the next, like, six week weeks until the sofa's come. But, yeah, hopefully um, we don't need to cook for our guests because... Uh, we've got nowhere to put any sort of food. No, literally, we don't. But don't worry about it. Don't you hit my defender. No, don't you hit my defender. Yeah, yeah, keep her going. Keep her going. Oh, my gosh. I just, I, I, don't, even, I don't even know what our guests are going to think. They've never seen our house before. And when they come up to their bedroom, all they'll see is this. What the heck? Excuse me, mate. Just got to uh, make my way past uh, <clears throat> an entire doorway within a doorway. And all this has still got to go downstairs. And now every time I bring one thing down, I take two cushions up. This is the world's biggest vicious cycle, man. Whew. You know, it's nothing like just doing everything all at once, is there? Like, honestly, I think even the flooring guys can uh, attest to what the average day of a day in the life of Tommy's like. It's just, it's madness. It's absolute madness. This is supposed to be the guest bathroom and there's a freaking bucket in the sink with water in it. Oh my gosh. I literally need to sit in front of this fan for a second because look at the state of me. I am sweltering. I have moved so much stuff. I'm trying to get it as organized as possible. Our friends got dropped off at the train station at 10 to five. It is now five o'clock on the dot. So that means they're going to be here in T minus five minutes. Oh, holy hecka. We did it. It looks presentable. It looks like a guest bedroom that someone could stay in and we just won't speak about the stripper pole. It's a curtain rail, but don't question it. But oh, I think that looks absolutely lovely. And would you look at that? For creature comforts of home, I put in the Dyson Air and Cool in here. Oh, yeah. Okay, now just to make sure they can actually get in the room, past the door, past the box, come on, pass it. Ah! I simply have nowhere to put these things. So I don't really know what to say. Oh, when in doubt, <laughs> hide it in her room. She'll never know it was me. She'll never know. Oh my gosh, she'll know I've been doing this. I am hauling some serious ass. And vlogging is not very efficient because now I haven't got two hands to carry two pillows. Holy heck, I'm zooming. Oh! Mama, holy mama, I am hecking hot. Look, oh my gosh, sofa sorted. Woo. Now, if I want some really big brownie points, I would find a home to put all this alcohol and put this room back to, together how it should be before she gets back. But to put it simply, I have no idea where I would put that amount of alcohol. I, there's no space in here whatsoever, none. But that's why when I'm a man on a mission, I get shit done. I am absolutely sweltering and talk about amazing timing. Cause I shit you not, our guests have arrived. I am a very sweaty Tom right now. Holy heck. I can't believe you're in my front door. Yes! Dude, I'm so sweaty, I'm sorry. No, oh good. my God, oh my God, come here. I can't believe it. Brother, I don't do any exercise. This sweat is me trying to get this house ready within five minutes. Hold, no, I, kept ru I kept running oh to God, the gate. You hired home renovators, right? We're here to help. Me All the way from America, get in! Lydia's about to find out why I'm so exhausted. Look in there. You ready? Yeah, sofa. Now come this way. Uh, you saw what? What did you see? You'll find out. You have a table back! <laughs> no, that's done. Trevor! I can't believe it. Dude. Bro, after all these years. Finally yeah, here. Like 13 years of knowing each other. 10 right? years of me living here. You're so at my home. I've watched so many videos here. So Does many feel weird to be here? Dude, Dude, I'm so sorry. I'm weird. so sweaty. No, you're good. You're good. I'm literally dripping. <laughs> the good stuff. <laughs> yeah, you, you, you do your fluffiness. If you're about to ask where's the door and all the boxes, I think you could guess. Hopefully not in my room. I'll put it back in there. Is it? Oh, uh... I know where to put it. I know where. Nowhere. Look, nowhere. Nowhere. I've tidied the bathroom. I just, I just can't believe it. <laughs> You're sat in my spot right now, looking at that view that I would just sit staring at. I can't believe you're here. Fucking hell, dude.
What a guy! Now, I know I feel already guilty bad because oh, these got shipped to the UK goodness. but then got shipped back because... Customs issues and I didn't get down to the post office in time. But I don't know whether I should hate you for feeding her addiction. Okay, these, the ones. these are the best things. Listen, these cups were Orlando <laughs> to Manchester to Orlando to London to Norway <laughs> to London to Manchester. They finally made it. Ray! Ray! Chelsea! 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 And great. Now the rest of my life consists of. Tom, will you go and fill up my water? <laughs> Tom, will you go and fill up my fucking water? I, I, to be fair, I should re everyone's reaction to that TV in the bedroom is absurd. That's and the thing is, seen. if you want to watch a TV whilst watching the TV, there's a TV in the end of the bed. Okay, but why is that in Why not? But can we just pull off a test? Do you actually fit in this bed? Oh, yeah. Uh, oh, no! <laughs> you don't? No, wait, lie straight. I don't think you fit in it. Oh, my God. Bro, you're the tallest person to ever step foot in my house. Yeah, you do actually be that. He said nice and snug, yeah. yeah. All right, noted. Uh, guest bedroom needs an improvement. Mate, look at the fucking size of you. You almost don't fit through the doorway. You're absurd. You're just absurd as my timing because um, I am now suited and booted. Suited. Not quite booted. Nice kicks, but not nice for where we're going. I forgot that I left. Ugh. Oh my god, what, what is this? Oh my god, my, my house is just an absolute shit tip. Look at the state of the car. Lydia went and got her car valeted, and when the valet had finished, they put everything in a boot, and she was like, I need you to take it out because I need to try and get Trev and Chels from the train station. So I had to take it. But all right, we're suited. <coughs> and we're booted. Because Trevor and Chelsea are here, we're showing them the town. It's going to be beautiful. It's going to be wonderful. So we're taking them to Adam Reed at the French. McDonald's. You wanted to go to McDonald's? Yeah. That'd have been so much easier. Oh, yeah. But we're taking them to Adam Reed at the French in Manchester. And our table was at half past six. As you've seen, rushing around, train stations, changing times, all that sort of stuff. I'll take full responsibility of it. We were running a bit late, but we rang them and they were like, yes, we can fit you in at half seven. <clears throat> I've had a shocker, right? I went to pick up my charger block or my other charger block and I was like, why are they not charging? Well, it would help if um, <clears throat> it was plugged in at the other end. And Trevor's just said, do you want mine? But why must live on? Wait, what? Wait, where'd you get this case from? Oh, it's how many? Two and a half. Which one have you got? Are you got the 14? Uh, it's like an Amazon. No, 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 no. 13, 13. Oh, 13? Yeah. I need this. I need this in my life. It won't fit though. No, no, you have the big one. Don't start saying I have the small one. All right, look at the fucking size. Everything about this guy is just big. I look like his child. It looks like he's taking me to a christening or something. Well, there's your big phone pack back. No, I'll just hope my phone doesn't die. It'll be fine. So for clarification, how tall are you? Uh, six, four and a half. Okay, let's see what you look like in this. Go on. <laughs> Wait, why is there a tub of Nutella? Wait, pick that up. Why? Why is there a Nutella? Did you bring that with you? Did you bring that with you? <laughs> okay, welcome. Do you know what? You look comfortable. Yeah, this works. Right, shut your mouth. All right. Hey, give us a bit of uh, that Nutella. <laughs> why is that in the car? This is this is your first time in England. Yes. And you chose J Jirac to come to. Everyone has <laughs> said, "Why are you coming to Manchester?" <laughs> and we're like, well, because we're here. Should be an easy answer, right? But welcome to our area. What are your honest, honest thoughts from from coming from Florida? What do you think of this place? Of England or of yeah, here? No, all of it. Well, okay, England. Uh, it's, honestly, it's been a lot of fun. London looked good. You looked like you did London well. London was fun. I, like, the people are a lot of fun. Everyone, really? Everyone kind of chats and talks yeah. shit, and, like, I, I like it. Yeah, okay. Like bit of banter to them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. But what do you think about where we're from? It's nice. Is it not random? Do you think all the houses look the same? A little bit, yeah. Really? Did you go Just you very farm towny. You think everywhere. this is farm towny? Kind of, yeah. Kind of <laughs> rolling fields. Yeah. <laughs> of what was going on right american you ready for this right now we're on the what is it the m60 Seven. right now we're on the m67 highway okay no, and you could no it's no, no, in american no, 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 no. i'm translating it all right we're on the i67 that's the off ramp that takes you off to the mall <laughs> why do you sound like a valley girl oh my god becky let's go get pumpkin spice lattes 
Where's Starbucks? Because it's Friday Frack. Oh my god, there's actually a Starbucks. We can even take you to Aldi. You'll fucking love it. Wait, where do we need to go? Oh what? Just to complete British, because I've, we've got an afternoon tea. We've got. <laughs> we've got you a we've got, we've got full English. Full English, let's go. Yes! The other thing that I think we need to get, get them on the way is. A Greg sausage roll. Ooh, have you had a Greg's? Everyone on Twitter said I need I to have a Greg's. Yeah. Greg's sausage roll. There to go. Hey, hey, there's a Greg's there in the mall. <laughs> Trevor's having an epiphany. He was like, dude, why are we doing 30 kilometers? And I'm like, it's miles per hour. And he's like, yeah. I forgot. Why don't you believe that we're miles per hour? I just I thought the U.S. were the only stupid people on earth. No, you're just idiot. No, because you just right. We you gave you, use, you we you gave you feet? everything. You use feet? Yeah, of course we use feet. We use miles, feet, miles. Inches. No, the one thing you've got different is temperature. We oh, do, we'll Celsius. say, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Oh my God, dude, Fahrenheit. So what, what's, what's freezing called temperature to you? It's zero, anything below zero is freezing. 32. What? 32 no. makes no sense. It makes no sense though. It really does make no sense. Yes, it kind of does though, If someone said you were freezing at 32 <laughs> here, you'd be like, that's impossible. <laughs> yeah, but when you're That's scientifically incorrect. But here's the deal, here's the deal. When you think about it, so 50s, 60s, that's like perfect weather. You get up into the hundreds, that's really hot. And when you hit zero degrees Fahrenheit, it's too cold to let the kids outside. So when you think of it of a zero to 100. If it was zero yeah, degrees here, percent. weather, people would be frozen in place. <laughs> <laughs> They'd be like, Mr. Freeze. <laughs> Kids yeah, 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 kids would not be going outside. Just for the record, we have been stuck in traffic for like 25 minutes, which is mm -hmm. really bad. And you know it's really bad when we've seen police, undercover police, and all sorts go past us. This is not normal for our the area. highlighter yellow is undercover? Wait, what? No, no, that's not undercover, you sausage. <laughs> the, the black SUV with blue lights is undercover. Yeah, 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 yeah. This is the content that keeps going. Wait, what do you call that? That's called a semi-truck. Semi do you know what we, we call that? A it's, lorry. It's a lorry. Lorry. <laughs> what are they lorrying? What does that mean? They're lorrying stuff. I don't what does know. That mean? It's that's what it's called. This is a car. Red that lorry, a that that's a lorry. That's a what? Lorry. Hey, what's that called behind us? An SUV. That's two wheel drive. No, no. no it, if it even if it looks like it's a four by four drive you just car, four by just call it four by four. Or what if, what if this is four by four? What if this is four wheel drive? Yeah, but is no it? one would call this a four by. No one would go. Oh my god, we're gonna four by four. No, just be a car. Just a car. Okay. <laughs> I love educating so, like, Americans. It's so talk, funny. Woo! Look, this is where we're going. If we can get That's in, fancy. I really hope they un they're understanding with the fact that yes, we did need to change the table table we arrangements, and we were stuck in. Well, I'm sure we were stuck in traffic the entire time. Yeah. We'll be all right. Look at this though. Ooh, on, so fancy. Go 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 go. Get your seven foot asshole out here yeah. now. <laughs> Trevor, Chelsea, welcome to that Manchester. That I didn't realize there was a police car behind us then when we did that, so my bad. That building right there, what do you think it is? Uh, Coliseum. It is? That's where they battle to the death. No, yeah. I'm joking. What do you think it is? It's gotta be a government building. It's a library. I was, boom. I Wait, woo. That's, uh, that's the Uber you get later on. <laughs> I, I, I'll be really impressed if they let us in now. Oh, oh, okay, yep, okay, 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 we're late, really sorry. Hey, welcome to the Midland Hotel. Look at that, there's a, there's a tree, there's a tree in the center. I'm really hoping they'll let us in, otherwise you saying you went to McDonald's is gonna be the case. Uh, no, it's Adam, Adam Reed at the French. This is some good food. Okay, I'm ready. Before, mm -hmm. I specifically said to him, extra shellfish. Oh, great, I'm super, super thrilled. I have I'm my glad you're back to you, me. <laughs> Do you have an EpiPen on you? I have a double EpiPen. I have you an EpiPen. Wait, wait, wait. You can stab her. I have a if it happens tonight, you can stab her. Oh, by the way, I get to make that joke because I'm anaphylactic as well. I have a question for you. In America... <laughs> double barrel EpiPen, bro. In America, what do you think oh. I... I have insurance. I have full insurance. What do you think I pay for this once a year? It's free. It's five hundred dollars a year. A year. Mine's free, and I don't even claim them. <laughs> I should do, but I didn't. French. Oh wait, that's that's not French. That's Italian. We need a new Merci. thing. Mwah. After you. There you go. Welcome to the French. Ooh. Oh, there you go. <laughs> I think. Do you want to take one of those? I believe that's your menu for the evening. Hello. 
she was parking the car. Do not say I made the pregnant lady. I offered. <laughs> you made the pregnant lady walk. No, I offered to pack. <laughs> Shut up. You, I, I reckon you made us late on purpose so you could have McDonald's. <laughs> you big fat American. <laughs> Oh, I am ready for this. I'm looking through the menu and I am realizing that 99% of everything is shellfish, my bad. <laughs> I'm like, we're gonna have like, first thing scallops, next thing salmon, next thing grilled cod. I'm like, <laughs> sorry. Okay, wait, let me try it first just to see if it's what I've had before. You can, or you can stick the bread in it. So this is some British cuisine put together for you right now. That's fantastic. It's all the parts I like of the French onion soup. It's like French onion soup. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's like it's French onion soup just going yeah, crushed together, right? Oh. You know you're in Manchester now. A cheese and onion pie. Ooh, where's your plate? Well, oh, it's going on the plate. Cheers. Well, I kind of tempted to see your reaction first. I don't know if you take a bite or, I don't know. Do you mean take the paper off? Fucking <laughs> hell. Good? <laughs> we turn around, Chelsea's peeled it all off. <laughs> and he's like, you're supposed to eat it. <laughs> really? <laughs> I said, look, I'm so hard then. <laughs> Do you like it? <laughs> Sorry, I'm crying. I don't think I've ever made that noise so high pitch in my life. How did you fit that all in your mouth? Do you have a six foot? Do you have a six foot seven? Mmm. Mom, I don't think you understand how big his head is. Look. His head's fucking massive. Wait. Okay. And I have long fingers. <laughs> yeah, you've got a big head. Jeez. Big, big brain. Mm. And it just pairs really well. We're getting with fancy right now. Proteins. What is that? Oh. What we love oh. is our Scottish salmon. Yes. I'm so glad we're getting Scottish salmon, not a carrot and sweet. <laughs> no offense, girls, but. What's sweet? I don't know. It's a vegetable. It's a root vegetable. A root vegetable. Yeah, but guess what we're getting? Smoked salmon. Cheers, mate. Smoked salmon. Cheers. Oh. So this Beauty. Is, oh, look at that. Cured oh. salmon, which we've cured in mascarpone sugar and salt. <laughs> that, that is, <laughs> this is my dinner for the night. I'm joking. Like, what, where are you, what? Oh, you're just using your eight foot arms to just pass, pass it over. Grazie prego. Grat oh, no, okay. Well, uh, grazie prego. <laughs> Gra grazie Thank prego. Thank you, you're welcome still. Because <laughs> I'm Italian. Oh, oh, what is this? Crackers. I'm just going to try this salmon on its own first. Okay, they said this is dill oil. Oh, yes. Are you guys dill Dude. fans? Because we just had a pickle. That salmon on its own is phenomenal. Okay, now let's try this, all this together. So they said? That carrot's actually delicious. Mm. Whoa! That is sour. That is sour. Ooh. That salmon's so nice. <laughs> but that that side bit is sour. Very... Uh, have you ever played Skyrim? Yeah. It looks like the, the bread rolls, like the dreamy, <laughs> yes. gorgeous bread rolls. Yeah, we, like we have some oh. Uh, oh, what? Tea towels. Oh. oh. Hell yeah. We have uh, Oh, beans. look at that. I'm salivating. Oh my gosh. Dude, I'm actually salivating like crazy. Yeah, that looks so good. I can't not just dive into that. Please tell me it's good. It is. Oh, all right. No, I'm, I'm having a mustard free one first. Meet review with Tom. Yeah, I feel like I say, wow. 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 That's nice. Oh, and the bread. <laughs> Look at that. Mm. Mm. Yeah, that bread is nice. This does not do this dish any justice in the slightest be be because I've, I've already eaten half of it. 
Look, I'm saying this right now. That is one of the nicest pieces of food I've eaten in all of Manchester. Top, that is incredible. Top five dish. Top five dish of my life. Really? So good. That was so good. I don't even know. Oh my god. Uh, that's the strongest statement, brother. Chelsea's, Chelsea so can't good. have this dish and she's got a substitute dish. Yeah, what are you and eating? She said it's the top five she's of hers. Meat. What is it? Bacon. Like a. So you're not having fish right now, you're having bacon? Yes. So I almost want to try that. You want to try it? I was gonna say let's trade, but then I realized you can't eat fish. <laughs> you can keep the spoon. <laughs> wow. Yours is like yours. Yours seems way more um, mustardy. It's, 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 it's mustard. Is this mustard? No. I was gonna say that tastes like mustard. Mmm. Wow. No, because I want to get that. Right, Chelsea. I don't want to upset you, but that's good. I know the fish is better, but as a substitute. Okay, listen, you said this muscle was incredible. This is not a clam. <laughs> this is a muscle, American. It is. I don't lie. Wow. Oh my gosh. If, imagine having a full plate of them. Oh my. Adam, Adam, Adam. Invite us back for an entire plate of mussels like that. Oh, incredibly. Oh, wait, what, wait, what wait, what's that face? Is this non-alcoholic wine? Wait, what? Wait, apparently the, the, the non-alcoholic wine is better than the real wine. Well, no one's tried the real wine yet. <laughs> it's so good. Oh! <laughs> Wait, okay, wait, let's try the real wine. That is so good. That's really good. That's really good. But I, 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 but I prefer my alive wines. Yeah, like yeah. The, <laughs> alive wines. <laughs> alive wines. I prefer the alive grapes because they've got life. That tastes good. Alive grapes. Yeah, you, you know what I mean. It's berries. Like, no. That's berries. You're saying you like this or that? Yeah. What I'm trying to say is I really like this one. The grape juice. Yeah, it's like it's like. Is that, is, is that not the one you said, like, cordial? It's very, it's a different berry. Trevor, dinner is served. Oh my lord! How does it taste? You can. Oh my god! I don't have the room for it. I don't have the room for it. Oh yeah! <laughs> I was like, that is some funky looking cake right there. What is that? Oh wow! Cheese time! Oh my gosh! My wine! Yes, thank you. By the way, what do you think of this? Because honestly, that is absolutely wild looking. But the t the taste. It's a little, there's a little herby. Yeah. It's like it's like a flavor bomb. Bro, there's a, the sorbet, the cheese, the herbs, the man. I like the herby. Wow. Oh my gosh, the aftertaste is so lovely though. Oh. <laughs> what is that? The whole thing's custard as well, so. Oh my god. It's very sour. <laughs> These guys are all having food cousins and I'm like... <laughs> what a way to go out. Have you enjoyed yourself? 12 out of 10. Have, yeah. have you enjoyed yourself? Tiny. I'm so full I can't even speak. <laughs> roll, me out. roll me out. <laughs> roll away, baby too. Roll back to kitchen. What a great night. Just went into the kitchen, met all the staff. Brilliant place, honestly. When people say, Tom, I'm going to Manchester, where should I go for food? I'll say like, Rita's Rain's amazing, this is amazing, but if you want a good like dining experience, Adam Reed at French. So what do we think? So good shout. Great success. Thank you. Great success. Great success. Great success. The Midland, you have been amazing. I've got 5% left and I get to say, we're not parting ways. You're coming home with us. I love you, buddy. You're coming home with us. I'm sleeping in your bed tonight. I'm like, look, just this, you and me. By the way, this is the realistic angle. Someone came up to me the other day, like a guy on the street, and was like, oh my God, syndicate. And I went, you're right, mate. And he went, you're much smaller than I expected. I was like, what the fuck is that about? He was like, it must be the angle that you filmed from. So realistically, it's like this. Look at him. He's just a giant. No. Oh, it's so good to see you. I, you, I can't believe you're in my hometown. This is so weird. This is insane. I love it though. After the, the whole reason I ever lived in LA is because this guy was like, yeah, dude, take my room. Take my room. He's like, take my room. The one circumstance is you can have my room. You can stay there as long as you take care of the soundproofing on the wall. And I was like, done. And then I lived there for like three, four years.
And now, here Thank we are. Thank you for that opportunity, bro. Thank Bye, you. Buddy. What a day! So what I was going to go is, would you like to experience culture of Manchester? And I was like, what's on at the theatre? Jesus Christ Superstar. An what? album that inspired a revel... Oh. Yeah, I tried to read it out and then the battery died on my phone, but guess what? <laughs> We're home! And I'm going to say this right now. I'm shattered. How many bags do Americans need? What is got? What is this? What? Okay. That is not one of those Wait. plane sleeping Wait, things. Please, please, please tell me it's not. Hi, Get out of my house! Oh, you a candle. It's not nice. It's not so nice. It feels. I think we're tired. Wait, 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 wait! Well, I just to make it weird. It's not romantic. It's just two dudes chilling in a bed. Is it? There's nothing weird about it, all right? Do you know the bed. weirdest part? The weirdest part is how long you've been up here doing this and then the fact that you got bored of waiting for us and went, <laughs> and hey, <laughs> hey, come and catch us in bed together. Hey, no, no, guys, was, come and catch honestly, us in bed together. I, I was laying here so comfy. I was like, fuck, I'm going to fall asleep. We, and I we looked, almost fell asleep. And Trevor was falling asleep and I was like, we almost fell asleep. I was asleep. like, we have to shut the <laughs> door just so we can get their attention. <laughs> but I'm like, this is the... This is the bed so in the house. I don't okay. understand how so we don't nice. have this bed. I'm gonna sleep with Lydia, but just so you know, Trevor likes to be jetpacked, so you're gonna need that. Yeah, I'll just, the back the there. Wait, what is being jetpacked? I'll turn over and then. Oh, you like being cut? Yeah. You like being. <laughs> I'm the fat man with the I'm not big enough. If I was taller than him, then I would be the big spoon, but, but I can't be, so I'm his jetpack. By the way, the reason why we're. You're came like a upstairs, turtle shell. We wanted to check Tom whether or not Trevor jetpack. could actually fit in the bed. That's beautiful. Does he fit in the bed? Yeah. Is it comfy? Oh, it's comfy. It's perfect. Have you showed him the guest book? Y yes, you've got to sign the guest book. You have to sign the guest book, Charles. Yeah, and you have to draw a picture. No pressure. Stella. Okay, wait, no. You're not sleeping with my girlfriend. No, I'm trying. To, I've been hey, trying to give you a gift, but you guys came upstairs. Wait, what gift? It's downstairs. Oh, I'm excited now. Go. Que pasa? Oh, is this my gift? How did we end up awake at one o'clock? Tony Smith will be here at 8 a.m. It was all that I'm just giving him the key. I told you just give him the key. It doesn't stop the fact that he's going to be using a spray gun to put on paint that's going to go. <laughs> I bet you I could sleep through it. Wait, what's that noise? Stop, no. <laughs> <laughs> I farted. Yeah, what? I Wait, is this a gift for us? Yes. Okay, it's nothing special, but it's something that we do for all of our friends when they have a baby, so we had to do it for you. What? And, uh, when you open it, I'll explain it to you because I didn't have like so the ability to get like a card or anything. That's so lovely. Wait, this is what you do for your friends? Yeah, I'm going to explain oh how God. it works after you open it. That's so lovely. Normally, I would have this in a basket oh my so you can see. Oh. Is it wearing a backpack? Oh. <laughs> have you seen our jelly cat collection, by the way? Yes, I know it's insane. So every toy that's in we there have has a book that goes with it. it. Oh, this is the most me thing. What's that? So as they grow up reading oh. the stories, they have a toy. Oh, there's more. What have you done? Why have you done this? <laughs> <laughs> so I can say I want to make story Wait, maps. Wait, what? Oh, so every every book has every book has, has a character a to go with it. it. Oh my god, you guys. <laughs> You're and then never. the minute we walked in, you were like, I'm going to start building a library. And I was like, yes. yes. <laughs> oh. <Yeah>. <laughs> 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 That's so much better than the rest. I think <laughs> that's not <laughs> my T-Rex in the backpack. Oh Mickey gosh. fell out of the box in there. Mickey was just Aww. because. Mickey's an extra. Happy. Oh, you big softy. To think I was about to go and get in bed. I'm coming here. <laughs> oh, oh, well, I don't Can we tell you this before you go? I don't know if she's mentioned it, but we've got this. Um, we need you to read a book on a, on a voice note, and then we put it into like this toy. It's like a, ch a children's toy. Oh, so then, like, you press play, and, and then it cycles the through time. reading the oh, book. Cool. But it's your guys' voices, and I'd love you to do oh, that for us. So one of these books. So one of these books. If you could do that, that would be so cute. The, <laughs> it goes from being British accent, British accents to American. oh my god, you won't believe this T Rex. <laughs> it's not even my T Rex. Where's the book? That is 
That is not my T-Rex. <laughs> That'd be so good. But not as good as taking the Americans to Grex. But you're gonna have to tune in tomorrow to see that in action. And I'm gonna have to end this vlog now. I hope you've enjoyed it. I cannot believe that I'm just walking around like my local shopping area. And he's right there. It's, it's, it's amazing. Oh my God, dude, is that the real Trevor? I can't believe it. Are you tall? Go away. You big he's like my biggest fan, literally seven foot tall, go away. But you guys can tune in tomorrow for the next weekday vlog, which I can't wait to share with you because we're going on a bit of an adventure together and just basically showing them like everything that we love to do in our local area and then some. So tune in then, make sure you leave a like button, click the subscribe button and ding dong the notification bell. And that way you guys will see the next upload in a day in the life of Tom. So until then, much love to your faces and adios.